Hematologic cancers are cancers of the blood, bone marrow, and lymph nodes. Essentially, they, you know, to, to be quite uh, simple about it, that they, they involve cells that are circulating in the blood or live in the bone marrow, such as leukemias. Uh, they can also um, manifest themselves as um, malignancies that don't produce enough blood cells. That's sometimes called myelodysplastic syndrome or bone marrow failure state, such as aplastic anemia. Or they can involve specific cells in the blood and bone marrow, such as the plasma cells, and that disease is called multiple myeloma. Uh, or cells that involve the lymph nodes, and those uh, are called lymphomas. And lymphomas are generally broken into two major groups, non-Hodgkin's lymphomas and Hodgkin's disease. And that's the, 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 uh, the gamut of uh, uh, blood and uh, marrow cancers. And there are different kinds of flavors of every kind of uh, leukemia, lymphoma, myelodysplasia, there are myelodysplastic syndromes in which the cells grow a little bit more and they're called myeloproliferative diseases or myelofibrosis. And then there are lymphomas that are uh, involving very low grade, uh, non-aggressive lymphomas and they can be called CLL or follicular lymphomas. And then there are very uh, severe, rapidly progressing high grade lymphomas called diffuse large cell lymphomas. Uh, and Burkitt's lymphoma. For the leukemia, it's the same thing. Uh, leukemias can be chronic, meaning that they're, uh, they can be controlled for a period of time, sometimes many, many years or decades with modern therapy. And then acute leukemias, which are fulminant and rapidly progressive and need immediate treatment. And those are diseases which uh, present very uh, significant challenges for patients of all ages, from children to adults.